Hey guys, Alfonso here. If you didn't read the title, you will know that although in the rotor in the previous video it said there will be a GTA 3 video on today, actual music, um, I've had to change that because I got a bit stuck and it was just generally annoying. And I've wanted to put this vid the video that's coming up next instead. So hopefully you'll enjoy that more than you'll enjoy when playing GTA 3. But with that said. Let's get this main video on with. Hello YouTube, my name is Alpha A for Alfonso, and today we'll be doing si something slightly different. We will be unboxing the amazing, the old, but still very well critically acclaimed and has a giant fan base game of... <coughs> over. Age of Empires 3. Sorry for the shaky cam. It all still comes in like a... Uh, another flappy box thing here but these things are absolutely horrible and nobody likes what you chuck in the corner so what is age of empires 3 well if you remember accordingly age of empires 3 if you know or remember of or have never played it before is a tactical ish building game where you expand through different age, we expand through different ages and build up a military religious and economic empire to forge through the different time periods from the stone age to roughly about what's on screen now the industrial age um the grain the game requires you to gather resources and build buildings to strengthen your empire and take over neighboring countries in europe and asia so now that you have a brief idea of what age of empires 3 is about let's get on with looking at what's inside before we open the box though there is one book that i took out the box and then couldn't fit back in called the art of empires essentially it's a massive art book uh there's the art one from the age of empires series age of empires doesn't give a name of who wrote it probably so it's done the contents includes lots of artwork from the game uh, black page uh, as a pro preface there's a little bit of description on there at last age of empires is a variable trove of art history uh, of age, a clay age of empires. I'm not going to bother reading that. Cool arts over there, though. Then you have the introduction. Great grains leave lasting impressions. I've counted thousand tens and never by some fun. This uh, blah, blah, blah. I don't really care. Let's see what's inside. Got some of the maps they did and just skip some two pages here. There's a German church and a German guy who no one really cares about, but let's say chips, other character models, sort of fun stuff. I'm upload some pictures of these in the description if you want to see something like you don't have a book on you. Sort of cool stuff like that. Close up there and push that away there. Now I can get on to actually unboxing the game, if I can physically unbox the game. It's going to be troublesome. Uh, then, so after numerous tries and a few camera hunts, I have finally unboxed the game of Age of Empires 3. Just remove the box thing and just chuck it over there. I don't want it anymore. So what's inside this giant box? Well, on top, there's, in this in the order that this came in, have the... I can just push over there for a little bit now. The... I think this is the Age of Empires 3 poster. Nice old... Tice Lewin Sombra Studios, which I think is shut down now. Yeah, it went better for Stoseman. Which is, I think this is the poster. Okay then, so after opening the poster after many failed attempts again, like with the main box, I've actually unraveled the poster and it's bold words of for king, for country, for glory. So very cliche. And what seems to be a bad the Battle of Britain versus the French, I believe. Doesn't particularly say, I just assume it's the French and yeah, I assume it's the French must have worn blue at some point. But there is the poster in its full on glory. For glory, kind of you know fits in right there and that. Okay then so after repacking that poster we can see what other treats lay inside the Age of Empires 3 box. Uh, first we have the booklet, booklet player's guide thing, 
uh, has cover the basic rules and strategy things, things like that. Introduction. The player's guide stress stent serves two main purposes. To provide a glimpse into the knowledge workings of Asian Empire's three plans to introduce details like the strengths and weaknesses. Yada yada, no one cares about that. And to sell for gameplay tips. And there's a good introduction or content that shows historic content that no one really cares about. Uh, it goes on about 30 pages about a player's guide, about how helping this place, and then finally about 20 page 15, 16 in, he actually then decides to, page 19 in, that actually decides to bother to tell you how you play the game, so, uh, yeah, not the greatest player's guide, but still, the artwork on the front is good, placed down there nicely, uh, after that you then actually have a manual with it, this is like just a mini manual that, ah, uh, it's just like a mini manual that is essentially is what the player's guide should have done that just never did and explain okay then so in the manual you can't really see it that well you have uh cities and how they work uh transport across water moving units essentially the things the player's guide was going to do but never really bother civilizations etc there. Then you of course actually have the game with its really boring cover art. Collector's edition, that's what that's called. Collector's edition says the game modes, command, the civilization you can do, ETC. Uh I don't know whether this cover was different from the regular cover, because I remember this having a very different cover art to this, but that must just be my memory. The regular edition had different cover art to this. Uh I'll just place that down. There with the other things. You can also get a demo disc, which I don't actually know what this does. Um, let's sound the back. I think this really is just a demo disc when the game was demoed or very first came out. Uh, yes, it starts to have some bugs, things like that in it as well. Share the Empire with a friend. I oh, know, I'll try that out myself. Ugh. Then, even further after that, there's more have the making of DVD in retrospective it's the making of of Age of Empires 3 it has no cover art yeah not has no cover art it has no sort of blurb or anything like that to it or back thing it just says the making of so as you can just see into the DVD case it really is just like a bland old DVD that would be nice to watch in a bit I might actually upload this into this video onto another one afterwards uh, I've just Put that aside for now. And there's also, so I was making of, a soundtrack, the Age of Empires 3 soundtrack. Uh, what's included on this? You have main title, Cross the Ocean Sea, Get Off My Band. It's really hard to see this. Um, tablet, Ferocious Junk, Russian. I, I, don't know, I think this is just instrumental. Like I said, the making of might put this onto another video or add this in at the end. Like, do this more than the making of. Let's put that over there for now. And then with the game, game, the game also had two expansion packs, which are also included with this. Have the Asian Dynasty, which is set in Asia. And this is, it's not just another chapter, it's a whole new age. It is all of Asia. And it's a latest installment as Japan, China, and India. Fight it, you won the war of the samurai apparently, and mighty shogun in Japan, and to stop oh, the mighty war elephant in India. That sounds very interesting, and you also then have the war chiefs, which I believe is America. Uh, yeah, it is America. It's all about US of A, and fighting for it. In the sort of 15, actually that would be a bit further, 15, 1600s, probably 17, 1800s. So that's generally everything that's in the box. I mean the actual box itself also has that lovely Age of Empires 3 in Microsoft in print. And so you can see the Age of Empires 3 logo and the Ensemble Studios and Microsoft logo just there. And so that's everything that's in the box. You can just see, you know, all the stuff I just put down on the floor there. A couple of other bits on the bed. Um, after this I just put on some artwork images that were in the 
Age of Empires art thing and some music on in the background. I'll like to do another video on the soundtrack. But if you enjoyed me unboxing the Age of Empires 3 big box of boxing just edition thing that never really got a name, please like this video and comment and say whether you want to see more sort of unboxing videos. Uh, it's not the most popular thing I can do, but still it's worth a different thing. And saying on that, A for Alfonso, out.